Hey guys, my name is Kaushik and welcome back to Let Code. So today we got a new update from Playwright and it's really awesome. Um, when I saw the PR in the GitHub Playwright GitHub page, I was little confused that they are going to remove the locators. But I come to know that they are not removing actually, they are just giving us some additional locators which is going to make our life really easy and as they said like with this new api writing locators is a joy and trust me i just tried it now and it's really joyful so i will do a detailed video maybe in some another um uh, in another video but for now i just wanted to show you the quick update like we have few locators now okay so one is like get by text role label placeholder text and the title okay so i'm going to give you a demo for few of them let's see one by one so for the demo i'm going to use this application called um, book at this particular site okay so what i'm going to do is i'm going to click on basically the uh, login link and i'm going to enter my username password i'm going to click on the login i'm going to search for a book and i'm going to check the book details okay but mostly we won't do the inspect in some places we can but mostly we will try to avoid that okay it's going to be re re really simple so first of all go to your package.json file make sure you have like version 1.27.0 and um, then just bring up your terminal and you give like um, npm i so that it will get installed the latest version then you have to give like npx playwright install so that we'll get all the browser binaries and few other stuff okay now let's go and write the test script for this okay so within the folder called uh, joyful locators here i have a test called get by dot test dot ts and of course the typescript so we are navigating to this particular site and then i have to uh, click on this login link okay so i can see that this is basically like a uh, link text here or maybe text so let's go and inspect just for your confirmation we don't have to so this is within the span but of course this is a text uh, right so here i can say like await page dot get by um text and the text is like login and i'm going to do the click action right so we are going to do the click action and after that what we are going to do we are going to enter the username so just in case if i delete my username and password and if i refresh so here you can see like we have a placeholder called uh, username here right so we have a uh, not placeholder it is basically like data placeholder so we cannot use the placeholder directly here but i can see that like uh, here uh, if i click on that here we can say like we have a label called username right so if i go and click on this probably like here you can see this something like we have something called username so if i go and inspect this particular label so here you can select within the label we have a span and here we have something like username okay i'm just going to copy this and here i'm going to select await page dot get uh, by the label and the value is this one so within the label we have a span and within the span only we have this text but still the parent is label so it should work okay then i'm going to uh, give like a fill just to pass my username that is or tony and then followed by i'm going to repeat the same but instead of username it's going to be like password so here i can change to like pass word and here i'm going to pass my pass that is pass one two three four okay then after that we are going to click on this login button for so if you see here this login text and this login text both are both are same here but they are different right so one is the link and another one is basically like same span uh we know that in playwright when we use the locator api that is like page dot locator basically it's a straight one right that means like if you have multiple matches definitely it's going to throw the error of course we can use the same uh like dot tenth of zero or one to do the click action but just to show you i'm going to uh, use the xpath here so basically we can use the same previously what we, we used to do for example page dot locator and the locator dot click this is also fine or else you can directly call like play dot i um, mean page dot click and within the x path that is also fine okay now once we do the uh, login 
if i click on this login uh then probably you can see like we have a search here right so let's go and inspect this one so here i can see like we have a placeholder uh so here you can see the placeholder tag which is like search books or author so i'm going, just going to copy that and here i'm going to okay so since we are doing the uh, page navigation once we do the login it's going to do the page navigation right so it is always recommended to um use the navigation command so i'm going to say like promise dot all and then followed by within the bracket i'm going to say like page dot wait for navigation and followed by this particular guy here okay and this is not needed anymore okay now i'm going to take this placeholder value here i'm going to say like await page dot get by placeholder the placeholder value and here i'm going to say like dot type and then followed by probably um we are going to search for a book the hate you give okay <laughs> seems very interesting okay now once i type this particular thing here i can see like we are getting something some suggestions so this is basically within the mat option we have a span and there we are getting that particular text right so this mat option is basically um it has a role called option right so i'm going to copy the option here and then followed by here i'm going to say like await page dot get by role and the role name is option and i'm going to store that okay so let's do like something like uh, const options equal to this guy and okay this await is not required because this is similar to your locator is directly returns the locator okay so if you see the return type it's basically the same locator okay so from there what we are going to do is uh, we are going to go to the options from there we are going to again find the uh, book name by the text so here i can say like it is within the span and the text is like the hit you give like whatever we are passing here so i'm going to take the same and i'm going to do the click okay that means like basically we are just trying to uh, uh, type the data so from that particular so this is like your span which is inside your role option of uh, like option role so from there we are just trying to do the click action okay once that is clicked for example this clicked we will get able to see this one right so if i go and inspect this particular guy here you can see like we have something like alt team alt name which is book cover image okay so i'm going to say like await then followed by page dot get by alt text which is this one and i'm going to do the click action okay so that's it pretty much easy we have done so far now what i'm going to do is once we click on that here you can see like we are getting a lot of things but which is okay just for the demo i think this is fine okay so we have used like get by text get by label uh of course the prom the locator is still there we can use that get by placeholder get by role get by all text so i have covered almost the new releases i believe yeah okay so now let's go and run this i'm going to click on this uh, run button uh, so this is one of the cool feature in typescript the vs code extension okay it just passed okay now let's go and see the reporter so i'm going to right click prevalent explorer here within the playwright report we'll get that let's open the syntax.html and here you can see like uh okay let's see the video okay it was really fast actually so here you can see like it's went to the login just da, 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 okay it passed okay i'm i want to show you something more on this like whether all our locators are correct or not we can easily identify that with the help of tracing so i'm going to navigate to my playwright config file and here i'm going to say like trace to on um and here within the test match i'm going to give this particular file location so right click copy relative path go here paste it here change this to this bring your terminal and say npm run test
okay and then just to see the reporter it's opened already and if i go to my trace file you can see actually okay so when i say like lo located dot click text equal to login you can see the red mark here right so basically it's trying to navigate get to that particular location and when i say like label so based on the label it's try to identify like what is this so if i go to this after you can see like it typed exactly in the same location and for the password also if i go to the after you can see like it has typed and then we are doing login so it's basically try to wait for the navigation to complete and then we are saying like login which is like your um, x path so we have clicked on this so this is like your race condition we this both are within the promise dot all and then here we are searching for the uh, image placeholder right so here you can see the page is actually loading but we know that playwright has capability to locate the locators automatically like after the load time so here if you click on this after you can see like it type the uh, the hit you gave the thing then we are clicking on the options yeah okay here some steps are missing i guess let me check once yeah so it's basically just right but that step is not captured i believe so here from the role option we have clicked on that and if i go to the action yeah i'm sorry if you go to the action you can see like it clicked on that particular so if you remember the hate you give is basically here as well as in this like the book cover right but it clicked on here because from the parent element we are referring the child element so of course it should work as it is okay then we are just clicking on the alt image so you can see the red icon right so that's a very simple thing now of course this is a dummy uh, like this application doesn't have much duplicate locators or a very complicated ui i'm just curious to see how is going to work in like some real time application but by the way the application i took is also really good but I hope you got the idea so get by text is not strict by default that is what i have observed so far i couldn't find any docs related to that and all the same methods are also available in locator frame locator frame so if you are using frame or frame locator so of course you can use all this stuff okay and then we have some other highlights uh, i'll just leave that up to you you can go and check this out but one thing i liked is like now the reporter we can launch we can open in a particular port which is good so by default it opens in like uh, 9223 if that port is busy you want to open in some other port you can do that okay that one configuration and something related to the workers let's not worry about all those okay so that's it i hope you have enjoyed the new release and this is really cool i felt this really cool and i'm really curious to use this much as possible and seems like we don't have to inspect much if you are using play right now okay so that's it quick update for this video uh, i will see you in the next one very soon Tada, bye bye take care and if you have any queries feel free to ask me in the comments or in our discord server so, uh,